What's up, family? Warning to all elected officials in the nearby Houston area. Dr. Candace Matthews is on the hunt. What is Dr. Candace Matthews hunting for? Corruption. Yeah, family, she can smell it from a mile away. Went to Prayer View A&M. Served some good old justice. Laid down the law. She would not be tried or denied. Confronted city council once again. Had them shaking in their boots, fam. Oh, fam. Hit them with charges of corruption. FBI federal lawsuits. Check out the video, leave your comments, and I'll come back with mine. Okay. Listen to this. What's from you? This is the sound of somebody that's about to go to jail. Look at this. This is what the visual is going to look like when somebody's about to go to jail. I know y'all missed me for the last couple of weeks because I've been doing some more research. And I had the media reach out to me because somebody on this panel reached out to the media. And they brought it to me. So let me make sure y'all understand something. That retaliation don't work with me. Because all the media is going to do is give it to me. And it's going to make me dig even more. And that's why we got three extra lovely boxes today. So I'm just going to go through this first box. I discovered on a the CARES Act and the American Rescue Plan, you had a certain somebody that has a criminal rap sheet that is 12 pages long. And y'all didn't do a criminal background check on this person, and this person is dealing with federal money. Mm. That's a problem. And this person has a history of theft and fraud. My God. Working for bread. And then, of course, this was the emails that I got from the media. This was the emails. And I'm letting you know now, I'm going to trace that IP address. And if I find out it come from one of y'all, so be prepared for a lawsuit. Here is the other folder that deals with 4B. Here is documents of kickbacks with 4B. Right here. Mm. All of this is going to the feds on tomorrow. Mm. I just thought I should let y'all know. Then, I got documents dealing with the release of information. We had several citizens that requested the 4B documents. I got all the release of information, and this is violation of release of information according to the Attorney General. And this is going to, not Ken Paxton, this is going to the one who they appointed. I got text messages of leadership sending stuff with 4B and talking about monies. That's right here. Mm. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. And also right here. So, I'll be here all night going through all these documents because every one of these documents, every one of these boxes have documents in it. Okay? So, I just wanted to put everyone on notice on this city council. Please. Because I'm not the type of person that'll go behind your back. I'm gonna tell you in your face. Okay? So, now that my time Please. is up, now that my time is up, Mr. Mayor, I just have one little thing and I'm done. Um, let me have, um, in order for you to keep uh, yeah, yeah. Mr. Mayor, she have more time. I, I just need one minute. Okay, well, one minute. I second it, go ahead. Thank you. And also, I would like to, State in my one minute statement. Hold up, we need to get some motion. You gotta get voted on. Gotta get voted on. Alright. What's up? Motion was motion. All in favor? All in favor, motion left, no one said aye. Aye. All opposed? Motion carried. One, one minute. Okay, thank you. And then also, I would like to bring up the process server. You may come up and serve these federal uh, documents. 
Thank you. Get ready for the lawsuit. No talking. No talking. Process, sir. It's up to you. Person, but those of you that's watching, just know you on this list, you can't hide because that federal lawsuit is gonna drop on your body because we're not playing. The city of Prague, you deserves better, and we showing results, not talking. So I'll let you know, Miss Prosser, Sarah Lady, thank you so much for your service. Anybody else? Almost all of them play that game, but if you're black and you play that game. You're going to jail. You are going to jail. The only way to delay going to jail if you're playing that game is if you are playing the game for them, helping to enrich them. Clarence Thomas, right? If you're doing that, you can stay in for a pretty good piece. But even with that, you could still end up going to jail if you piss off the wrong person. You catch my drift. So you gotta be very, very careful when you're dealing with these politics, dealing with campaign funds and stuff like that. You gotta be very, very careful. And you gotta play by the book because like I said, if you're black, they're just looking to take you down and they will fill that seat with somebody that they can control. Color is irrelevant. But what say you fam? Drop a comment. I'd love to hear your thoughts. RIP Prayer View City Council. <laughs> Woo. Candace, Candace, Candace. No more talk. What the haters talking about? Yeah.